Hi guys, I'm Simon and this is an architecture tour of Half-Life 2, although I mean I'll, I'll admit there's not much architecture going on. But uh look at those mountains. Anyway, we are in episode two of you know the Half-Life series, Half-Life 2 series, and oh we're here. And uh we just got past a hunter ambush. And now we are driving again, although not for too long. Well. Hey, I know that peak. You can see it from White Forest. <laughs> We're heading the right way. Good, good. Well, hmm, what was I going to say? I was going to say that this driving section is somewhat different from the driving section in the original Half-Life 2 because for that one. You might remember that most of the stops along the way you could just bypass. You could just drive past most of the things and just not deal with them. Although of course I played through most of it and uh, you know I went and explored every building. But in Half-Life 2 Episode 2 most of them are gates in the sense that you know you have to open the gate by triggering some sort of event before you're allowed to move on. Anyway, let's check out this. Look! It's one of those advisor pods. Back in the citadel, those things we saw. Yes, it is. An advisor pod. Crashed, and the advisor's not here. Hmm. What could that mean? Of course, I know exactly what it means because I've played through this game several times before. It's foreshadowing. It's foreshadowing. <laughs> Let's not mess around. An advisor pod with a missing advisor. So we are. Let's see. Well. Uh, what? What was that? Well. There it is again. We know what that is. But uh, what I want to know. There's an advisor around here someplace. Yes, there is. What I want to know is what kind of building is this? And by the way, we've seen this van like dozens of times throughout the series. <laughs> Usually there's loot in the back. There's a barn and a house. And I guess under normal that might get annoying after a while. Under normal circumstances you would call this a farmhouse and a barn, except there's no farm attached to these buildings. I mean, there's no... There's trains over there. There's no, there's no farmland, there's no fences. Well, well there's this. Oh, that's interesting. We don't actually leave through this one. We leave through the other gate. But there's, uh, there's another gate here, that's interesting. And yeah, there's an advisor. <laughs> what does that say? Six six nine. I mean, that's 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 lead speak for barn B, you know, four A barn. What is that? Six nine E. What could that mean? Uh, usually it's like a G E. What's what's an X? What's a six? Anyway, if you can figure out what that might mean, you can leave a comment. That's probably that's probably barn. I don't know what that is. It's probably some sort of joke or Easter egg that the artist put in. Uh, let's. 
don't think we can break this. Oh, we can. I wonder if this will be useful later. I think the screen's getting more and more desaturated as well, like the colors are not as bright. I'm not sure. It's pretty cool though, I mean, having these graphical effects indicating the, the presence of, of the advisor. Uh, hmm. What else do we need to do? Nothing, I guess. Allow us to proceed. Pumpkins and also... Huh, the barn has no... Oh wait, was there a door on the other side? Okay, there's a door there. I was gonna say there's no front door. But no, there is. It just doesn't face... The, the main access, I guess. I mean, this is a door, but obviously there's a fence here. Are there zombies? No. Ah, uh, indeed. Indeed. Uh, these guys didn't do too well, clearly. loot. Anyway, we have an event and we have a set piece coming up. You might have guessed already if you haven't played it before. I think we found our advisor. The board said we should kill them before they hatch. Sure. Hmm. Ah, life support. What do you say, Gordon? Shall we pull the plug? Yes. Sorry about this. Hmm. Maybe I can get this open. There maybe, we go. Maybe you can. Over to you, Gordon. Do that sort of thing. Oh, my God, Gordon. Thank God you're all right. That thing was hurt. Did you see it? Yeah. I can yeah, only I imagine what it would have done if. Uh oh. Autonomous unit subsumed. Sounds like it called its friends. I mean, I understand that Soldiers. they're powerful enemies, but if they're that powerful, you gotta wonder why they don't just take care of business themselves. Why do they bother sending such weak underlings to do their work for them? See the barn. Oh, wait, do the doors match the? Yeah, yeah, it does. Okay. So the car is out there. The other building's over there. That I guess should be the main entrance. 
There's nothing in the barn, though. Shells of some sort. I mean, of course, the combine is taken over and then put in this to house their advisor. The structure is good. Good. It's all. It's all very good. Yep. Yep. All right. Nothing more to say, really. Thought, ooh, oh, I got this. I think we're meant to use it. Oops. I mean, I, I don't really know what this bit would have. Like, what the purpose of having a corridor like this would be for a barn. But anyway, we've got enemies. Where are they? I think we're supposed to use the crossbow to snipe. Well, might as well. Hardly ever. Oh! Hello, there's uh. You! Why? Wow, I suck. That's more like it. What am I stuck on? Okay. There's a helicopter. Well, that was that was pretty good. The barn was aside from the fact that there's no associated Whoa. Like there's no farm associated with the farmhouse. Aside from that, it's pretty good. Let's grab some ammo. 